Yay, we've got transcoding. Hello, good evening, and welcome to the stream. Yes, indeed. Uh, social metering. Yes. You know, because reasons. It won't take long. Right. Discord. There we go. And book face. I suppose we could do um, a book face. We're getting there slowly. It's funny, isn't it? Seven years ago, we all thought Bookface was a kind of cool thing. And now we question <laughs> everything about it. Londis, welcome to the stream. How the devil are you? Right, okay. So I'm not long dinghead on this too. My God, it's dark. It's the middle of the night on Rubicar. Let's Let's go somewhere a little better lit. Now I'm thinking... Is it time for a bit of a re-gear now? You know, the XP arm has been good so far. KP Alexander, welcome to the stream. So I'm just thinking, I, I did have a Froob MA, didn't I? Someone donated some dragon armor to him. How am I? I'm okay. A bit tired, funnily enough. It was up early this morning. I don't know why. Some noise somewhere woke me up and, uh, yeah, I've just been awake since. And then dozed off after tea and then woke up again going, oh, I've got a stream, haven't I? Uh, and felt tired again. <laughs> Doing well here. Uh, just a zing, yeah, okay. No, wrong thing. Logging in my Froob account for a... a for a second. No. God, what's wrong with this? Right. Eh, fatty Foo, I think it would have been. It looks like I may have borrowed things from him, but we'll have a look. Blame the bin men. No, they're Fridays, though. Londis has just subscribed at tier two. They subscribed for 14 months. Currently on a 13 month streak. I didn't hear that alert for some reason. I saw it, but I didn't hear it. Why? Why did I not hear it? Huh, working. <clears throat> Didn't know I unsubscribed. You didn't. You subscribed. Okay, he's not wearing his chest armor. Not sure why he's not wearing his chest armor. Oh, bag full of nuts stuff. Oh, you can't see him, can you? Uh, display capture. Yeah, I'm just... So he has no chest armor. Living dragon claw gloves. He's got those. He needs 320 MA skill. That's that's the only thing I, I can see being a problem borrowing these off him. Hmm. Interesting. Why is he not got it on? Who else might it have been on then? I think he's got everything else. He's just not wearing that. Yeah, all his implants are still in. Custom 200s. Hmm. I 
Yeah, it just says it just the alert didn't play. It just says Londy subscribed at tier two. They've subscribed for fourteen months. Well, if you went from tier one to tier two, it could be to do with that. I don't know. So we go back from Space Quest and uh, Quest Space. <coughs> we'll have a look on another tune, see if they've got it. This is this is just something that Mahalik said last time he was on. Oh, you want to get the dragon um, chest? And I thought, oh, I've got got that. Maybe it's on the other MA I made. Like he borrowed it for a while while I leveled that MA. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yeah, if you change subscription type, it quite often does that. Fatty fool. Let's have a look at you. He's not wearing any armour currently. If I semi strip this character for bits and pieces. I think I borrowed all the implants off him. Uh, probably for the MA. Now, someone definitely gave me dragon oh, uh, body armour for him, but. What the hell have I done with it? I definitely haven't sold it or given it away. So what have I gone and done? Maybe I gave it to this guy for a short period while, you know, let him wear it for a little bit, but... I was thinking of getting that, maybe some other stuff, see if we couldn't get into it, you know? Some officer or scout armor or something, you know, just... Not just XP armor anymore. <laughs> kind of deal. Gamble0007, zero, 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 welcome to the stream. No, he hasn't got it there. What the hell have I gone and done with it? Oh my god, I'm in Egypt. What have I done? With his dragon armor, what did I do with it? Have I gone and put it on the mule? It's possible. We'll log in the mule as well and take a quick look, see. You never know. It could be there. Got a sneaking feeling it's not, though. The OFAB chest has 2% nano damage. At anything above quality 150, as well as max nano cost and plenty of AC. Yeah. Would I have used it on the Keeper, maybe? Wouldn't have used it on Doctor. Possibly used it on the Advi. Hmm. Let's have a look, see. I'm looking at my mule at the moment. Uh, 
No, the me chest. It's got the same icon when it's uh, a bag item. It doesn't make it any easier to find. Ah, oh, there we go. Living Dragon Body Armor. So our damage for 42, 12,000... Oh, uh, 1.2k ACs across the board. But it's 375. We're thinking the OFAB chest though, are we? Possibly, possibly, let's... I don't know how much VP I've got on... Um, my main NT, even, so... I think I gave myself some of this as well. So we've got Scout's Legwear, which is Title 5, which we're not that far from, but Sense and Intelligence from 8.15 is a bit of a push. I don't think we're putting that on anytime soon. Would be nice, but... Mm, sense that high? Hmm... <laughs> I can't remember what I wore on my main NT, to be honest. So, like, the 150 is nearly 3k. Could easily do that, I think. Psychic and sense. We're at 500 and something, so what's the 200? Or the 175? Two percent damage efficiency. Yeah. 200. Mmm. Psychic at... Five six four intelligence at six nine seven. No, we're not quite there yet, I and mean, I think we've hit breed caps anyway. Pretty sure we did. What's the chest giving us at the moment? Given it's purely XP, yeah, the ACs are much lower. Froza, welcome to the stream. We're just looking at maybe having a bit of a re-gear, seeing as, you know, we're coming up to Title Five soon. Possibly, possibly. Helmet and chest are definitely worth it. Five, six, four. Let's have a look on GMI as well. I think the 200 may be too high. Six nine seven in tally. That's going to be bloody hard on our trucks, especially as we've hit max for your breed. Yeah, so that's not going to change until well, quite a bit later. Nikto one, welcome to the stream. What 
It's on GMI. 250, 100. No, that's not good. And the helm as well, you think? It's got nano cost and matter creation on it. Delica! Hey, Carl, how you doing? Doing okay. Looking at a minor re gearage. I suspect I upgraded the OFAB armor I had on my former NT. I can't remember though. Yeah, to get the plus 2% damage. Hmm. After that, there's a bunch of HUD and whatever items, but they're sort of, you know, higher level, two, you know, 200 plus. Have a look on the old NT. I doubt they've got, I think any of the OFAB armor they had that has probably been made no drop by, you know, upgrading it to penultimate or what have you. What are they actually wearing? Yeah, scout armor. Special edition nanotech helmet. Which is quite nice, actually. They would have had something like... How much BP have we got? Oof, no one here to go buy some. I could easily afford it on the uh, Enforcer, but you can't shop in different classes shops, which is stupid. Do you have nano targeting helper ready? We've got a max quality one on. Nano targeting helper. One of these. Yeah, I could put that on. A 300. 1200 matter creation, 1200 complete. Uh, I could squeeze into that, yeah. I don't have one uh, ready though. Looking for hand me down. Siljo Russell, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Put the 300 compiler in. Got Lobi body armor there. Quality 25 is not going to cut it. <laughs> no, it's the circular mod chip. Need square if you're going to make one of them. This is all quality 25 again, I think. This must have been a set I got early on. <clears throat> I'm kind of stuck with it. Probably for longer than needed, but... Yeah. 
oddities on the tune, like support symbionts and stuff. Maybe just loot from raids and things. Nobody else wanted to pick it up and carry it, so I ended up with it, I think, maybe. Yeah, we've already lifted all the extern implants that she's not actually using. The rest are alphas now, so... They live with the tune! I can't remember how you make one of these even. Phil Joe Russell has an image for us. Let's have a look. <laughs> okay. Formula One cars are now kittens. People say doom ready made. It'd be under deck, wouldn't it? Now targeting helper. 1.5 billion somebody wants for one. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Have a 218 one, four percent damage, that's not bad. Yeah, most of them are quite, you know, reasonable price, but then suddenly, like, the 300s are going for... Wait, what? Are they... Um, they're player-made, aren't they? I seem to remember. ICC, Planetwide announcement. Sunshine 2 has been awarded the highest honorary rank for outstanding dedication to the defence of Ruby Carr. You can wear two at the moment. Oh, can you? Uh, the next highest is, there's a 245. They're not unique. HUD slot 1 and HUD slot 3. Oh, while well, I'm here, I wanted to check as well. See if anybody's got an eye implant yet. That's worth getting. Not an effective, which is 176. No, there's lower ones than that. Just nobody's got one for sale. Original sound effect of Formula One cars. <laughs> okay. Cat that makes a noise every time you pick it up. I might go for the Dragon Armor chest. And uh, everyone's saying do the OFAB thing, but I can't buy, you can't, I, like my enforcer's got 90 odd K of uh, VP points, but they can't shop in the nanotech shop, can they? IT Oderi, welcome to the stream. How the devil are you?
No alert as usual. Nuts. Yeah, the only thing with the dragon armor chest is 375 MA skill. Which on a lot of melee classes paid is not a problem because you get the that from various implants and stuff, but on this tune way we're not even halfway there. And it's dark blue as well, so I don't think that's gonna be a thing. Oh, you're very big. So what's the requirement on this? So I've still got that one in. So that gives... That's 4%. And then... Thank you very, very much. Yeah, but doesn't the MA skill without it, doesn't that make you OE? Is there not a um, skill check on that? It does make it OE, yeah. This is the problem. It requires a, a weapon skill to equip. Uh, then that can be a problem. Let's do some shopping. You've got 50k VP on the NT. Well, if you build um, if you build a, an amp, I can get you a full set of 300 for them. <laughs> Dela says hello, everyone. Yeah, I think 175 is about as far as we're going to get. Because I'm at breed caps on base abilities and stuff. Okay. Uh, nano target. So we're 214. Four percent as well. Two, four, five there for cheaper. Which is another four percent. Two, twelve, one. And that's another four percent, yeah. This is a one twenty three quality. Yeah, it does drop. So at what point over 200 gets the 4%, I think. Yeah. Get that one then. What quality can I equip? Um, I, not quite. I'd have to twink to get the... 300 in but it'd be doable I'm not playing paying one and a half billion for it trade on MA oh I said I'm with you I'm with you I'm with you hang on let me make sure I got some space okay Thank you very big. Okay, so I bought that. And still no Exterm Ocular. I'm sure I had better ones. Um, I had some symbionts, but I don't think I'd get them in yet. I think they need another level, possibly more treatment than we've got as well. Or more treatment than we can get to. Savik, welcome to the stream. Right, you trade this over. Uh, 
Foundry log. Yeah, the MH has to be nice. It just... Meh. IP into MA skill on an NT. I get the plus damage part of it, but... Accept on Cal's foo. I've just bought one. Okay. Thank you very much. Not sure he could get that on, though. Uh, actually, yeah, he probably can get that on. Might have to shuffle a few bits of gear around, but yeah. Did you finish the Adono Brain Quest yesterday? Monday. Yes. <clears throat> yes, we did. Uh, let's have a look. Complet. Got 10.35, so I could perk that to get into it. I wear this one for now, which I can just put straight on, you see. That one... 10.84... Yeah, I could do. Let me take that off there. Pop that in. Uh, use the basic buff. <laughs> That's going to get you a lot closer. Entirely buff. It's 1060 and then... <clears throat> a pistol, I think. I'm going to be the answer there. Can I put the pistol straight on, I wonder? Not with that on. E I think it's in this one. Yeah, they've got the Loby pistols. Okay. How is the full auto? Oh, probably because I had a load of other gear. <coughs> Put on, where are we now? I think I had a load of base abilities maxed out as well. And the trickle down would have raised the full auto, I think. You think? I don't know. Yeah, I think that's how I did it last time. Burst you can buff anyway, but... Ranged comps, yep. Yeah. And beer moth I need. And we've got an enforcer. Hey. <laughs> oh wait, 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 I've got a plus three ring. Can I get one of them on? That's 165, yeah. Um, 
Zazen, or Zizon, rather. Welcome to the stream. Beer Moth. Yep, Beer Moth does it. So that's one. 1880 something. And the other one, that's without reperking. Obviously, reperking would do it. Right, okay, so now we've got 11.02. So we'd be taking off the defensive HUD. And going for the lower one first, I think, or maybe that one. Yeah, that one will work. Matter creation is required to be... Oh, is my buff run out? We think it did. Yeah, that ran out. <coughs> what are you giving me? Yeah, I can't equip that yet. Thanks, but I can't equip it. So, appreciated, but... <laughs> I can't... Oh, Jesus. Let me make some room, then. Appreciated, though. Uh, okay, you can go in there. Why have I not got an ocular exterm implant? I know damn well I used one on, on the tune previously. Do not seem to have one any longer for some bloody reason. You're going to forget about it. Okay. All right. Thanks very much. I'm going to put that in this bag. There we go. Right, that's gone in there. Now I want to put this one on, but I need... Yeah, they're a bit low. I, I'm sure I had one that had, like, a 110 requirement on it, which was quite quite a bit better, but it if I can find it. I know I had it on the other tune because I, I went back and looked at me playing on the NT and having it and God knows where it went. Right, I'm just going to log my MP and give myself buffs. Um... Yeah, should have enough space, I think. Right, so I'm going to close this momentarily. F10. Quit bouncing on the MP. Okay, relog.
You know, double check my MP and most of the symbionts he has on him are all control ones as they are sort of dotted back and forth with the Engi and, and other tunes so God knows what happened to that Right, Nano and casting ten sixty five. How much did it want? Ten eighty four. Ooh, nearly. Uh, have I got? No, I don't have the general buff running. It's run out. Do I not have it? I do not. <laughs> God. I don't have the general nano skill buff. Oh my God. Have I been running around without that running? That's embarrassing. Range physical nano expertise. No, I haven't created... I don't use the favourites window since they knackered it. How do I not have that bugger running? Oh, I did have it running. It must have been virtually greyed out then. Twelve eighty and where's Nileb's gone? Otherwise, I'll have to <laughs> yeah, bigger buff. Get moochums instead of something. That would do it, but. We can do it and keep the other one. Soon, my pretty, soon. Title 5 and a lot of faffing around. Okay, where's, oh, there's no labs. Twelve nineteen. Oh, you give me a wrangle. <laughs> okay. So that goes on there. Let's lock that one so I don't forget. Lock that one as well. Okay. Um, Back armor. Alien tank, maybe? Perfected alien tank armor. Not especially useful. No, I've, I've got them on now. I've, I've done the hard part. Uh, I need to take things off. Right, those two are done. So I'll take this bag, put this bag back together. Leave the XP one on or go get a prisoner cloak. Yeah, maybe. You go on there. You go there. Right, you traded the nano tech armor to the MA, didn't you? So, ah, uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, intelligence is required to be six ten. Little high. Yeah, 610, the Intelli's really high. I'm not a bazillion miles off, but... The 
There's neuronal stimulator, then there's another one, isn't there? What's... What's it called and where'd you get it? There's there's a couple that come after, but I think there may be quest and level locked. Ah, it's only spec two. That's spec three, but look at the requirements. <laughs> I remember rightly, doesn't that? 195, Enfram's Cortex Accelerator. 145, we can just about do it. Is that a Shadowlands one by any chance? Let's have a look. Shopping by profession. Doctor, Enforcer, Engi, Fixer, Keeper, MA, and MP, <coughs> NT, what the hell was it called? Izzy Gimmers, Hippocampal Augmenter. Not that one. Enfram's Cortex Accelerator. Penumbra Garden. Right. If only we'd done the Penumbra Key Quest. <laughs> Anyone has any idea if we're a pain for our parents when we were 12 years old? Guaranteed. Uh, guaranteed you were. Bought mine on GMI. Yeah, but I've I've got the key on about four or five different tunes, so... Eh, uh, has one, I know that. Kalos 2 definitely has one. I guarantee you, you were a little, little shit when you were 12 years old, because every, everybody is. <laughs> right, Penumbra Garden. I've got my keys with me. Penumbra Garden, Penumbra Sanctuary. Eight minutes on there, okay. It's payback kind of... Oh, yeah, yeah. M my lad is way less aggravation than I was at his age. I know this. Because <laughs> uh, I am uh, self-insightful and, ref and um, reflective. Where am I going? The wrong way! I was not, I just went to Germany without telling... <laughs> yeah, that's not a problem. Said no parent ever. I, I went to another country with my friends without saying anything. Yeah, totally not a problem. So 145 on that tune. So this is just about hitting it right to be cast in that, I think. Uh, when I was about four years old, I went off on a bike ride over a railway bridge, over a main road, went and played with my cousin and stuff like that, and it wasn't until I was on my way back, I went past uh, my, my nana's house, you know, my grandmother, went past her house, ringing the bell on my little one-gear bike, and went, hello, nana, and she went, who are you here with? And when I came to see Cousin Frankie, she went nuts. She dragged me into the house, phoned my parents. He's over here. He's come over the main road bridge and blah, blah, blah. And, you know, I'm surprised I didn't put him in an early grave. Enfram's Cortex Accelerator. There we go. Oh, anything else maybe I could be casting? Not a lot, I don't think. Right, okay. This is honest, the lowest key I have on this tune. I suspect it is. I've only got to do, um, like, 
a couple more keys on here. Yeah, those are the specs I want for fatty balls. Mr. Um, oh no, they're not Ash's specs. Mr. Hadrolf's specs. When you wear them, they're the exact same mesh as um, Carlo. Wrong bag. Uh, let's go to Inferno. But I can't remember where the hell they drop. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, kids exercise different brain muscles these days than the ones we did. You gotta remember, you know, when if you grew up in an era that didn't have computers and, and mobile phones and stuff like that, then the way the world worked was different for you. Versus now, you know. Where they they're born into a world where that's just how things are. No nascence key on the Advi. No, apparently not. I guess I just never did it. It wouldn't take me long to go do it. Then I'd have that one. Then I'd have to do... What else is missing here? Yeah, then I'd have to do Elysium, uh, Garden and Sank. So on and so forth. And then Sheol. Garden and Sanctuary. Right, okay. Yeah, I was a little bugger when I was a kid. I really was. Mr. Hadrolf Specs. Give you nano pro max nano and nano programming, but I can't remember where you get these from. And I want them on fatty balls. Because when you wear these, they look like uh, Carlo's sunglasses. <laughs> Rubicar mission, yeah, quite possibly, yeah. Okay, Biomet 970. <laughs> That's a lot. I had a friend manage to get stuck in the chimney and his mum had a hard time hearing. He was stuck in there so long she actually reported him missing and only found when she thought it was a bird in the chimney and the police officer filing the report wanted to catch the bird and take it out. <laughs> oh my god. That could have gone horribly, horribly wrong. Right, can we cast him now? Uploaded. Cortical Accelerator. Intelligence 606. We need 610, I think. We can does. We can do the thing. There we go, 626. Chest armor. Head armor. 
And the trouble is it's OFAB, so it looks like cardboard. So I've put them on and then hidden them. <laughs> hey, hey, Carl, I'm on the platform of Pyramid of Home on the crack, and I'm super nervous. Ah, no need to be. It's only a raid. Worst thing that can happen is you'll die. You know, don't worry about it. <laughs> right, let's take this back off. It has no room in here. Um, any room in this one? No, obviously not. Why did I get the med suit? I have zero need for it. Getting this armor as well. Okay, uh, you can go there. Right. You go back in your bag with the others, and you go back on there. If you die on the last boss, there's a 10% chance your character gets deleted. Lies! Don't listen. They're just trying to scare you. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Did you come up with this stuff? Noah, stop terrifying people, please. Right, we've done all that. I have actually done all the dailies today already on this tune, so... They've done the wreck, they've done all the regular dailies and alien dailies and such, so, yeah. Log off the Muel. Although, now I think about it, I could make, um, before I log him off, and I'm thinking, always a dangerous thing. Which bit do you convert the, I've got the, bits for penumbra goggles and all that kind of stuff so i can just immediately turn them into a ring so i'm just thinking now would that be a good idea also i've got the a bag i shouldn't have on him yeah this is supposed to go back should i do that now <laughs> are you good yeah why what's up i heard something loud drop that was my shirt your shirt fell and it made that noise i was inside of it <laughs> good stuff yeah it makes that sound when you put some on that size in it daylight 97 welcome to the stream hello from the cold north of canada yes it is, isn't it? It's, it's very cold there at the moment. Right, let's get some buffs on the go, which means let's log off this tune. I wonder, if I give him these now, so it's a visible light, um, energy redistribution, and dynamic gas, isn't it? He can start converting the bits you get for your rings. He's also got some boots. I'm only listening today because I'm driving home. Very good. Hold hell at bay. I'm just looking at this on the alt now. On the mule. Oh, you've got to be Title VI to wear it. On self below 201. 
one and a resist 200. I think it is, is it? But you have to be title six to wear it, so 190 at the at the lowest. Title five for the other rings, yeah, possibly, yeah. I'm gonna trade him the parts. So we've got them there. Which one goes with the scuba gear? I can't remember now. Is it this dude? Yeah, so that will give me the underwater ring there. Been working on the NT. Yeah, title level three for that ring. So there we go, we've converted that into a ring. And then bag of win. I'll put the other two in here. Seeing as I have a few of them. Zinzig, hello, hello, welcome to the stream. It's also got a great ice golem on him there. And some Inferno boots for another time in the next 15 levels. Who is this? Devalvus Ring. Just so you do not convert up as the last one is Title 6. Oh, that's the um, Inferno boots one, isn't it? Yeah, because you're using the whole hell of bay, aren't you? Kind of thing. That's the complete... Yeah, that's the combined ring, isn't it? Yeah. That makes sense. Right, let's get a fixer. Give myself some NC yaw. Okay. They can actually team to you can team with two hundreds now as well. Woohoo. One four five. Wish me luck, I'm going in. Good luck. Follow the instructions, stay situationally aware, etc. etc. Deluxe Sky Cannon version 2. Yeah, pay attention to everything going on around you. That's the trick. 
So we're all all about the damage now. E get a few other buffs redone as well while we're here. Where are we going to go? That's the the question now. If it goes wrong, will we see Sky Cannon 3.0? <laughs> Good point. I think the it was Sky Cannon, Sky Cannon 1972, etc. And it carried on and on and on and on. All right. Uh, five balls. All right, just before I get into all this, I'm going to make myself another drink.
One more second. Right, I'm back. Yeah, number one son was uh, learning. I could hear it because of these open back headphones. I could hear him learning, well, teaching himself rather. Uh, Johnny Be Good. So I was listening. I was thinking, yeah, he's nearly got that. So I went in, took my guitar. I said, it's like this. <laughs> so you get the way it, it's. Um, when you play the intro, when you finish the you're on the you're on bar two, you're on the second chord of the song by the end of the intro. Which is what a lot of people get wrong when they're learning it. So he's there, but he's he he doesn't really need me to teach him now. He's got the internet, but I watch him and I go, No, 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 you wanna you wanna use your fingers like this. Or, you know, because this guy he has definitely got it wrong. I see a Dela hanging out at <laughs> Storm Hangout. Okay, so I timed out my log off. Right, we've got that, 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 that. A reflect. I already have it, apparently. For two and a half hours. Dela Gamble, one, 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 one. Welcome to the stream. He's progressed from Daylight 007. Right, we need to go out and have a bit of a test run now, don't we? Go kill things. Hello all, says Spa2112. I hope all is well for a great day for you. Indeed. Hope everyone's having a good time. We're halfway through the week, so there's that. Halfway through the week is nearly done. You gotta gotta get up tomorrow and Friday and it's the weekend again. Yay! Right? Augmate just ding 220. I missed it. I was I was obviously at the login screen and missed it, unfortunately. following me for you burke um
can't wait for this weekend this week to end i got my first date in eight years on a friday good gravy i don't know what i'd do on a, if i had to go on a date now haven't been on a date in 20 something years so yeah What do people do on dates these days? It's just to me, last time I was going on dates, yeah, Rusty. Well, you just used to do stuff, you know. You didn't make it into a big deal. It was just like, you know, do you want to go and do this? And we just went and did it. Didn't really question it, you know. It was just, let's go and do a thing, and <laughs> that was it, you know. Ah, the desert music of perpetual wastelands. Yeah, we were all in college, like going back to college together in our late 20s. So <clears throat> we would just meet up as a group just to hang, you know, chat, drink, smoke, you know, chill, basically. That's that's where we got started. So it wasn't even really kind of like dating. It was just us, you know. Time for you to and your wife to have a date night. We we still go out, but we go out as a family because they've got the kids and everything, you know. Kid, duh. you know, we're going to be empty nesters soon. <laughs> that's going to be weird. You feel the core of your being shift as the source makes room for a divine presence. Charina or Charima? Charima has reached enlightenment. Congrats. Yeah, enjoy yourself. Just don't don't worry about it. Just, you know, take it for what it is and, and just try to have fun together. You know, that would be my thing. Well, I'd always go, do you want to go and, um, the movie's not very good because you can't talk or, you know, you want somewhere where you can have a conversation and interact and get to know them and, you know, so. Yeah, dates and movies are, are like, they're, they're like, really the whole Saturday night the movies thing was both of you still living with parents and, and being like, uh, well, we can't come to mine to make out and, and all the rest of it. Cheap, affordable cars became the thing. Going out for a drive, you just find somewhere secluded and use the car, you know, as somewhere secluded. Now, for me, I'll probably go, uh, there's a group of us going on for a walk up such and such a hillock somewhere. Do you, do you want to meet up and go do that? And then you've got the whole day and you get tired halfway up and you sit down, you talk and look at the view and, you know, and you're in a good mood because you've got the endorphin release from going and exercising and all that. So when you're older, you've already got your own place and, and all the rest of it. So it, it's quite different, I guess. Yeah, I'd, re I'd be really lost doing that now. Can you go somewhere secluded in 2020 without giving off rapey vibe? Well, this is it, yeah. No, that was, you know, that's like second, third, fourth date kind of thing. You, you don't need that date because you're adults with your own... You know, you got the whole uh, I live, I have a place thing sorted out. And the other good thing is if, if you have a meet-up between groups of friends, then you're more likely to be yourself because you're among your friends anyway. You know, so you'll feel more natural and all that. Avoid a forest. 
Last day we went shopping at Mal for a two hour drive or as a date. It's just something to do and spend time together, isn't it? You know. And I just cancelled reduced inertia. I'm a muppet. Okay. I see no red dots, so I suspect someone's been pulling all the mobs. There's one there. Where's it? Where's all the others? You do not want her to meet your friends. Then she's not the one for you. Tell you that for nothing. <laughs> if you're not comfortable with your friends meeting her, you know, unless your friends aren't really your friends. Doesn't look like there's anyone up here. No, nope, there's no kite team. Where's all the mobs? The boneheads. Well, that's okay. They're an acquired taste. Well, maybe you are as well. You don't know. Excuse me, game. I came here to kick ass and chew gum, and I'm all out of gum. Come on, where, where's all the Borgs at? This is looking a bit better. There'll be loads more of them than this, though. Testing out new gear. Oh, here we go. This is a bit more like it. Don't lag on me now, game. Try to get one near the middle. That's better. Killed a bunch. The lower level ones. I thought they weren't bunching up too well. Bunch of people watching me amateurishly kite. Bunch of Borg solo.
That's not bad. Do I want to drill decks to right T? Is it? That'd be. <clears throat> Someone wants your XP. Seems like it, yeah. Looks like he was out here and died. We need my armor. Hmm? Not yourself. Don't need loot. Help yourself. What I would like is one of these buggers to drop. The token board. Ah, there we go. That was all I'd want from these, I think. See if they've respawned at the other end. That wasn't bad, that was fairly quick. Level there, wasn't it? What do you think? Where else would we go? Have these started to respawn yet? Looks like it. Not nearly as many in here as the other place, though. I think the other place is better for grabbing a big lump of uh, mobs. Yeah, I'm looking at my mini map, I'm not really seeing many more. Yeah, there's only a few there. Get in the group with the others. There you go. I can't think of any mobs in Shadowlands where we'd be able to do this. That aren't a nightmare to deal with. Like longer range and... But you do get more XP per mob. It wasn't running yet. It'd run out just before the uh, end of that, but I popped it again. I think we're close to 10% nano damage now. With all the pits and pieces. 10% of 1k is another 100 damage, so... Not knock it. Nano cost is nice as well. Are you not... taking damage? You are now. Yeah, sometimes they resist, don't they? Kind of a pain. Oh, I haven't got PNH in that running. Yeah, should have remembered that. So I was thinking of an idea of a character creations of an MMO game. The only option you got is to select the name. And it's a waiting game for nine months. Plus 18 years before you can play the character, but you need to stay sub. <laughs> the new uh, NFT. 
They are a big Ponzi scheme, aren't they? They are such utter garbage. I'm always amazed anyone with any intelligence thinks they're worth something. How can something with no physical value be worth anything? You know, it's... it's it... <laughs> it would have to be something like a driving game's um, last save of someone. So you could see their ghost driving around, that kind of thing. So you've got a sense of the person from it, whereas an NFT is just a copy. It's a copy of something. It's not even... Ugh, just what a Ponzi scheme. And NFTs aren't something that's been done for us. They're something that's been done to us. Don't forget that. Spirit room in the temples. Yeah, they can be a bit gnarly, though. Would be better XP, I think. Isn't this the, the spot here? I've seen people stood here doing this. Nah, I don't like it. Seems like a cheat. Seen someone doing it though. But with the you're about to die music, we're not. We are good at this. Sort of. I haven't got as many as last time, I'm guessing they've not all respawned yet. Like the sea breaking waves on the beach. It's been a while since I did any kiting either. I love watching to kite. I want to see you go to do to any kite in these. <laughs> kiting borgs. No. I might try a spirit room then. That might be an idea. But I haven't done a spirit room as a kite before though, but they, they can drop dots and nano uh, steel on you and all sorts. And the gloomy and dark. Kite spirits in Imp Temple before. It's okay, SK, but they're taking revenge on you. 25% <laughs> survival chance. Yeah, this is it. I've just had the nicest compliment ever from my org mate. That's nice. What level are these things? 190-ish, yeah. Yes, tell us the compliment. There's no higher level mobs in the wreck, is there? There's whirling rocks, but they've got like ridiculous range on them, haven't they? From memory.
Then you're doing really well for the first time. Yeah, you're more likely to die doing it the first time than any other. That's a certainty. There's a few around here, but not many. Oh, grats. You're obviously paying attention and doing what you're supposed to do. So it was a nightmare figuring that place out, though. It was also fun, but there was a lot of death and frustration going on. As is the way with every new dungeon when it opens. No one knows how to do it. Everyone dies trying. <laughs> you died twice on the run. That's okay. That's probably about my average. Yeah, I usually die at least twice. Fluff something up or what have you. Unless I'm doing that dungeon quite a lot that week. Then I die a little less. But not much. I'm looking on the mini map for more mobs. Come on. Where are all the mobs at? There's only a handful here. It takes as long to take down one as it does to take down a hundred, so... More or less. No. What the hell is the computer doing? Why am I got nearly no frames a second? Oh my god, that wasn't fun. I was moving on body memory then, guessing where I'd be if assuming that the rest of the game's running. That was weird as all hell. I don't know what that was. It was not fun. I tell you that for nothing. <laughs> like what? No. I'm going to die. Once a maiden in the last boss didn't cast the root in time. Yeah, there's, there's a thousand things to go wrong in those raids. Am oh, I suddenly taking way more damage? Ah, it was weird. Do not like. Don't like the weird. Always worries me. I always think my computer's dying or something, you know? And then I remember, no, this is Anarchy Online. It just has its moments sometimes. I struggled more then than I did on the other side with ten times as many. has found an extra mob from nowhere so we can get a few more from over here this time death is part of the game it certainly is 
I don't think this guy's going to follow me all the way into the other base. They generally don't, anyway. He has got boiled blood on him, though. Please have all of them respawn dead. I don't think they have, though. No, a few stragglers. Nope, not one of them. We're not going to spend the entire evening kiting one of them. Only to have it run away when it gets lower. Okay, I'm looking at the mini map. Nothing much. Nothing much near him. Looking for little red dots. There's some on this side over there. I think they're just outside the wall, though. Not seeing the animations some of the time. Yeah, there are a few there. I've got to take them out through a gate to get them, though. Even without grid space, I'm kind of... Yeah, this is it, keeping them from resetting. I don't want to pick up the mass commando. And I probably will. And it's GTFO if I do. Can I get them all the way to the others on the other side of this wall? Yay, looks like it. Together, let's try and do them here. Some are going to be much lower health than the others, so that's going to make keeping them tight hard because their run speed's going to get all over the place. You are more focused than this cat. <laughs> Predatory instinct. Yay! Another ding, I can't see what I got. 147.
Keep them all nice and tight. scraped our nano pool if I'd have had PNH and cost running and I don't. Delica, he's borging again. Me only fight. Have you tried kiting hecklers yet? Don't have the run speed. Need a lot more run speed for those guys. Guy said he was after Mai's armor, didn't he? Minimum, yeah, maybe more than that as well. They're always like a pain in the arse to kite, though. 725's been done. With faster than your shadow, we're at nearly 13. Go and try some Elysium Hex. Yeah, we've just dinged. It's worth a shot. I'm going to get PNH, though. Uh, that means I'll be losing our, our FE though. Have to, yeah, this is it. Can I be asked? Spirit room might be the way. Yeah, it could be. I think we're saved in Adonis at the moment. He used to have a 126 NT twink just for kiting, yeah. Let's go and swap out some buffs then, so I'll be using my own thong here. Uh, space, oh, I wasn't even using that. That's embarrassing. I forgot one of my own major buffs. Apologies. 1540... Run speed casting all, self casting all manners. Nice. That's a bit of a twink, that. Yeah, this isn't any kind of twink. This is just me gooning around leveling up a tune that we made uh, not last week, the week before. When did I? Hang on. <clears throat> uh. January 20th, we made him on a Thursday night as a bit of a laugh, where everyone, we had a poll and everyone voted in the poll. <laughs> that was kind of it, that was all it was. And even then I was saying, I'll get him a quabbit because I'm not going to keep him, it doesn't matter. When I, when I delete him and make a new tune, I'll have all the veteran points again. And now here we are, nearly title five. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you can go nuts with twinking. I don't really need to though. He's he's more sort of a utility build, really. An XP armor. He's got the syndicate brain, which is nice. Yeah, there's some nuts twinks out there now that are legit, and I'm impressed by them. There's also uh, people that cheat, unfortunately, and make things that are, like, literally impossible. <laughs> they put, you know, like, beaters on a 160 where, wait a minute, there's a title lock on beaters. How have you done? That's not possible. Yeah, stuff like that. And it's like, honestly, do you think people don't know? You know. Go, well, go to the west side beach, yeah. I was thinking of going there anyway, because mostly the other places are always camped. Doing it from Kite Hill, yeah, without an outside tank, yeah. Or doing it in the water around there, yeah. I have done it before, it's just a lot of... It, it's quite sort of... Um, it's quite stressy rather than... 
fun. <laughs> it crosses the line kind of thing. Uh, what am I going to give myself? How many buffs do I want? I want to get layers, PNH. Yeah, we would be okay. Layers, PNH. Okay. Third NT. Yeah, well, fourth, I think. I did have a 215 Solitus one, but I just didn't... I, I don't know why. I just didn't like them. Um, I ended up deleting them. After I made the Op Effects one, I've got it's sort of 220 alphas, all the toys sort of thing. Okay, Let's see if we can get both of these done. Probably not. Fumbelina, there's the other NT. I just found out my first AO NT is older than my daughter. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> when your tune is older than your kids, yeah, it's kind of scary. PNH. Cost. Sit down. And then we're going to log in and get... Uh, give myself layers. Get the poor guy his own PNH and cost nanos. I should. I don't know if he could cast them yet. I'm not even thought about it. Probably, yeah. Uh, he is paid and all that, so... There we go. And he's already got beer moth, I think. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Personal note and harvester. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you should get that. No VE. Kells does more damage, but it's ridiculously slow. So damage over time, it's not as good. VE's just so low cost, actually. Let's have a look at stats now. So, <clears throat> add all def, 353. Skill lock, where's nano? It's about 10% we've got, because the buff is... That's 7. There's a couple inside the symbionts. There's 1% in that one. Uh, so 7, 10. No, 10's in the extra one. 2 in is on that. <clears throat> so, yeah. 10, then... You're getting near getting near to sort of twenty percent, but where is it on here? Interrupt nano modifier nano delta. It is on the stats page, I just can't remember where now. Nano delta execution nano mod nano modifier it can't be. Nano modifier, so 19 over 100, yeah. Close to 20%. Me only fight. Sadly, I can't play anymore. Oh. It is essential. VE won't end well. Yeah, what else have I got? Oh, we, um, oh, we, have a look. Uh, Blaze of Hephaestus, not much else, really. After that, they're just much lower. Uh, 
Isn't there like an AC's buff? I can't think what it's called. Let's have a look. It's so long since I've had to look for nanos. Yeah, I found it in the end, Dung Freak. Thank you. <laughs> you did say twice. I know. I was looking at the screen, not at the chat. It happens. Uh, AC buff. Can I do any of these? Chronos Sphinx is now following. Thank you for the follow. Yeah, so... Um, fleeting... Are these... That's um, Nano Deck. Advanced Fleeting... Mu Mu is that a quest one? Chronos Sphinx. Emphrams. Yeah. Is there a level lock on that? Is he giving his mockery? No, that's... I don't think I can cast that. Oh, maybe. Unless there's a level lock on it or something. You got given... Did I? Are you sure? I think I did. I don't know if I've been given that. And I wouldn't have done anything with it other than put it, leave it in the bag for later or use it. Is he giving us mockery? Oh, well, there you go. There's Handy Harry. That's the top one, it is, yeah. So on the AC's one, Fleeting Immunity. Isn't that a quest one? Nearly misplaced a four billion dollar <laughs> nano god, is it? That'd be scary, wouldn't it? I knew I hadn't done anything daft with it. Yeah, the Absorb, it's better than... Um, Causating screen, isn't it? Yeah, I'm just looking on here. Advanced fleeting immunity, and there's one above that. Superior, but that's nano deck. Advanced fleeting immunity. Is that a quest or nano? Bronto Burger Quest. Bronto Burger Quest? It's an Ashley Winstead Nano. Oh, right. Is that worth getting? We, we could go and do that. That could be a thing. You're saying, nah, don't bother doing it. Don't do not do the Bronto Burger quest. Really? It's quite long. Use the lower one until the DB quest, and then what? Just use the DB quest nano. Okay, well, we're going to go and try some Heckler's. Let's have a look. Nope. Nothing on Stella today. The other thing I miss having is <laughs> overview of the Shadowlands. God, I miss having that nano. Just having the map all the time, everywhere, without having to think about it. Wrong map, okay. There we are. I'm gonna need that. I've 
I've got Kel's Neutronium plaything. I've got the discs. Um, but isn't Kel's like incredibly slow? I could I could make a Kel's, yeah. I've got the disc. I just need to build it. You're saying go get Kel's, are you? I don't think it's better, you know. It might be easier to land or something, but... What's the cooldown on Kells? It's like six seconds, isn't it? You can't stop all the time to use VE, you'll die. Yeah, but you can insta-cast it, so... Is that... To stop? You're not, you're not really stopping so much as well. I'll get Kells made. Um, but I seem to remember trying to use it before and just thinking, God, this is annoying. Uh, Kells, you make the old way, don't you? Yeah, this is what I mean. The recharge is like... Ugh. So by the time it's redone, you could have cast VE four or five times, so. All right, we're going to go make Kells. I think I've got that on my big NT. I'll trade that over to my Engi and he can definitely make it. Seven and a half seconds, yeah. I don't think Kells is the way to go. I really don't. Vulpu, Kel for kite and last hit, you say, right, okay. Uh, Fumbelina has definitely got a disc for that, I'm sure. I don't think it, that, I don't think that, um, I think she actually uploaded it, but I don't think I ever used it. I don't think it ever stayed on the hotbar. Don't know. Not seeing it in that bag. Yeah, there you go. Neutronium play thing. Go try with VE and see. Yeah, if they hadn't changed hecklers back in the day, they'd be easy. 25 metres on Kells. 20 metres execution range. Yeah, but that's how far the AOE spreads, isn't it? Quick mule. Oh, the range on the nano. I don't, I don't think it's that much different, is it? VE's 20. Not sure if I've got any carbonium rocks, but we'll see. Right, Engi. Been a while. I think the last time he built a nano, someone came to him with GA4 and said, your colours do, aren't you? And he goes, Would, can you build a nano? And I went, probably, yeah, on my Engi. And he says, well, I found a GA4 and I don't trust anybody with it. I said, well, any you know, reputable trade skiller would not rip you off. Um, on principle alone, you know, never mind the damage it would do to their reputation. Said, Can you make it for me? Because I know you'd never do it. And I was like, well, yeah, but a lot of people have, you know, just as trustworthy as me. Anyway, so I ended up making it for them. It was so made up.
if I can remember how to do it. The old way is different from the new way, but I think this is an old way one. I don't even know where there's a list for such a thing. Uh, what have I got in bags? I'm going to have to Google it. I am going to have to Google it because I can't remember. Uh, he online. Nano. Yeah. Crystal creation. Yeah, there we go. Symbol library. Yeah, it'll be combat. I got one. Space. Yeah, let's go and have a look. I don't think I've got any carbonium though. Need carbonium. Nano crystal model combat. What quality is the nano when it's done? Two twelve, okay. 224, that'll do. Ooh. So the symbol library, photon particle emitter, I think I've got that. One nine six, probably high enough. Um what other bits do I need? I've got that in a bag. Symbol library combined with... Okay, let's try that. Symbol library... No. Symbol library. It should be combat, shouldn't it? Symbol library combat. Do I need to do something to it first? Common process. What's the new process then? Is it this one or the other one for that? I wish there was some sort of list that told you. Uh, do we have recipe still? No recipe matching cows. Okay. Someone's trading me a rock. Carbonium 241. Yeah, that'll do. Ore extractor. Then I want the that high enough level. I missed a step. Neuron neutron displacer. One five six, that's too low. In there, will it? No. Where the hell did you get that from? Uh, so I don't do trade skills, they just annoy me. 
See, it should just be that. But it's not. Try this with it. I think that's too low to use, though. I don't know. Here you go. Okay, we did that. And then... Photon Particle Emitter. Oop, wrong tune. Two, four, five, just to be sure. And then finally, prepared and thing. No, it still doesn't bloody work. What have I missed? So it's not this way. It wouldn't bloody work the other way either. For fuck's sake. Ayo hey trade skills. Kicking your ass since forever. Right, so that doesn't bloody work. So we've got the other way. It is the old method for that disc. Well, yeah, because we used the combat one. Bad program, blah, 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 blah. Doesn't work. So we've got combat. Uh, refraction price in combat. Nothing. It won't go together. Symbol library combat. Fucking hate trade skills. Yeah, and that is, it is the old way. So we just wasted that nugget. Unless the program crystal won't work with it now, will it? Yeah, th this is what winds me up. If there was one way to do it, yeah, if there was one way of doing it, it would be fine, but there's not. I can't use that with it, can I? Uh, what do you do next on there? Done that, done that, did that, did that. We got that. We did that. Prepared. Spe yeah. So. No, that one won't work with that. So I need another fucking... Oh, I hate trade skills. They're stupid. Inconsistent. That's it. but I mean the whole game's like that. Pick up and right click. Pick up and shift click. Click from inventory. All to do the same bloody thing. Ugh. Uh, I'm gonna get another bloody chunk. A two four five is too low. How is it too low if it's higher than the crystal? Confused me now. Luvio, welcome to the stream. Nice to see you. Ignore me being cantankerous old man swearing at trade skills. That's why the amateur TSs use the TS window. You mean the pros? The pros use it when they're bumping implants. Make sure they get the exact quality. Or do you just do that without the trade skill window? Because you can't, can you? So I don't think so, Vulpu. <laughs> nice troll, though. <laughs> <clears throat> this implant needs to be exactly 126. Slider. Just logged the wrong tune in.
And the only thing it's for is to check quality. Yeah, okay. Nope, that ain't it. I'd have been happy to just go in and try and VE. I don't think Kells is the way. It's too slow. The time you've cast it, you've got 20 bloody hecklers on top of you and you're dead. I'm not, I'm not really believing that. So he's saying this won't work with it, it's too low. Quality 254. There you go, and then we go. No. That's too low, yeah, that's 119. Ah, hate trade skills. Prepared program, yeah, it looks completely different than this one so we got to do it this way so i need another carbonium rock well, that's it i've never been a trade skiller so never wanted to be either I mean, all the trade skilling I did on the Engi was um, making the pistol, mostly. Is it Southern Artery Valley I want? No. Central Artery Valley. Eight L. <clears throat> yeah, whenever you need the slider, you use it, don't you? Simple as that. Yeah, I use the carbon. It'll take two seconds to get one, it's no problem. They're not hard to find, are they? You know, there's, there's like a couple of places you can go and get them and <laughs> they're in all qualities wherever you go. One six nine. One oh eight. One seven three. Two thirty. There we go. No, oh, we've run out of uh, first aid thingies. literally grow from the ground yours wrong window oh you couldn't see me oops there you go I just went and got one fine Okay. Thank you. Check Engi window. Right, right, right. Yep. Right, so. Going to the old way. We've done the first thing there. Photon particle emitter. Have I got one? 
usually got bits. Nope, I don't. Need to do... Make that. And the isotope separator. So that is now 137. So that should be fine. Now you can do one more mistake. I think the mistake was building this pig in nano. Photon particle emitter. Quality. Really? Is that the height? Does it matter? Oh, I hate. I don't think it does. Okay, what's the highest quality one? One eight six. Okay. This we're not using. Why is it in there? Trade skills are a pain in the ass. Neural di right displacer next that looks the same as the other thing. Neural displacer creates that. Crystal reflection pattern space. Oh, well, we want combat, but yeah. Two, four, five should be fine. Add them together and we should have the item. All right, okay. Kel's neutronium plating. There we go. We got there in the end. Why did they have to come up with two different ways of doing the same thing? That's just why. You know? Why? <laughs> that makes no sense. Uh, you can mule it over. How much nano in it? Probably not enough. This is what I'm saying. It Like, every time I've tried to do the Kells thing, I've just gone, yeah, never mind. And ended up back on VE. <laughs> Savik is the boss. Yes, she is. I don't know where she is tonight, actually. Could be busy doing other things. Who knows? Don't know. Is she online? She's offline at the moment. Could be busy. We need to put on the belt six for 700 nano oh the quality 300 viral compiler yeah it's on not sure if i've got no i haven't got the dock buff running yet but i'm full otherwise let's have a look nano init 1637 Try to summon Savik with a spell of cuteness. I'll go on then. Ah, Cute cat. Bring in your hair bubble. Cat playing fetch. <laughs> nice. That's adorable. 
be into the cast with the dock. Yeah, but then what have I got to give up then? Oh no, I've got it there. 1987. Woohoo! Was a good year. I was 18. I was 18 that year. Yeah, very close and whatnot and maxed. So, <laughs> fun, fun times. That red tape. What, improved cut red tape? Yeah. As soon as I can squeeze it in, I get it. Too good to just leave behind. How do I not? Oh, one map overwrites the next. I hate the map, nanos. Just get rid of them. Just give everyone map access to everything. It used to be worse when you needed adventuring skills, so you had a load of adves running around equipping a bloody banjo just so they could buff. Heckler's check, duck splat. Yeah. They chuck duck explosive. There you go. <laughs> Where's it put it? I haven't traded it to myself. Oh, Jesus, wept. Yeah, banjos and mitar. Someone someone was amazed that the mitar is actually an instrument. I was like, well, of course it is. You have to get the banjo to equip the scuba gear. Yeah, all that bullshit. <laughs> Unnecessarily complicated crap. Yeah. Ah, oh, my God. My tar, sitar. No, a sitar's really quite different. Ukulele, my tar, guitar, they're all quite similar. Uh, sitar, very different. Yeah, l most of them have got some sort of adventuring skill on them. Yeah, I'm less likely to be critically hit, though. Go, you don't need duck explosions. No, unless you're going to PvP. Like, NTs don't need strength, mate. And like, 16 comments from the same guy. Why are you putting into strength? NTs don't need strength. Because I'm going to be using symbionts, and you need it for that. Oh, no. No, you can blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 and then made one video where I go, look, strength requirement. And he finally shut up. <laughs> it's like, don't want to be rude to people, but sometimes they make it very hard not to be. Right, okay. And you can log off now. Right, Kells. Oof. There it is. See what the cast time is. Slower, yeah. Good thing you don't hear the hit of hecklers from a mile away. You die silent like a fish, yeah. Yeah, it does, yeah. This guy, honestly first umpteen episodes of let's build another tune i think he actually deleted the comments because i didn't i left them i was gonna pin one after i made a video where i said right we're now gonna put i think it was like um right we're gonna put the right arm in or the left arm or something like that yeah you go left arm with add def strength 406 and when nts don't need strength what are you doing, you new? NTs don't use strength. Oh, God, the guy. You know, when it's just the people that don't know as much as they think they do, trying to tell you you're doing it wrong when you know damn well you're not. Use the circle of the... Yes, that's how kiting works usually. Don't be inside the circle.
Crash Core 105. 12.5 fragments, 12.5 to go to get you to sing mode. It doesn't last long, and I have to do it kind of tunelessly because... Ugh. Sing anything too well or familiar, and suddenly you, you upload the VOD to YouTube and, and you get a copyright claim on the entire video. Healers and redeem check posture. Yeah, quite comfy, actually. You should all be always be slightly inclined anyway on a chair. It's better for your back. Even though it looks like you're slouching, it's actually better for your back. Oh god, right, so what, you want me to check my posture, sing, and, and drink liquid at the same time? <laughs> Hello, mobs. Would you like to play with me? I have a new nano. It's called Kells. Oh my god, the recharge is ridiculous. Just wait there while we wait on the recharge again. Do you have an insignia for me? Yes, you do. Thank you very much. Now we're going up to the garden. <laughs> All this to die horribly to hecklers. Delicar says, but that is an awesome to XP gain. Yes, it hits for three times as much, but you could have cast VE three times in the same amount of time it took to cast and recharge. Okay, where are we going? I'm thinking... Up round there. Did I see the cat song? Yeah, the guy retuned the cat's voice to be a melody. It's kind of a cheat, but yeah, it was good. He did a good job of it. But if you if you um it's called vocoding. So you can take any sound and make it act like a sample. Oh, you remember the old keyboards? No 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 nineteen. 19. You remember that? It's basically doing that, but in a more musical way, in real time. Now, there's, there's a better bunch on the other side of the bridge, I think. You literally spent an hour just faffing around to get Kells and come here. <laughs> and we're going to die. <laughs> That's what's going to happen. It's really never, ever going to end well, is it? Let's face it. There's usually a bunch up on here somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Who knows me, eh? You do get hit. Not much. So let's try Kells.
wish the um, bloody game would zoom out a little more. It'd be easier. See another little red dot there, but come on. I can't even see the buggers. I just know they're there. I'm looking at the mini map now. Yeah, the whole jumping thing is bullshit, you know that. Makes no difference where what your um verticality is unless it puts you out of range. It looks cool. Maybe you're not moving any different and you're not confusing the AI. Oh, really? Oh, we've got the uh, What's It boss. It looks cool. Yeah, it can't, I remember it being more of a thing. CNTs with um, wolf kiting with VE or something like that. You do a big pull, one with jumping and one without. So, yeah, but what does the jumping actually achieve is my point. I've tried it with and without. It seems to make no difference whatsoever. So I go with what I can discover you know if it, if it makes no difference at all then it doesn't matter if it's always been a thing how many more of these do you have to kill before this bloody thing goes away Yeah, I know. I've seen people do it, and I've always wondered why do they do it. <laughs> Registers your position on the server. Mm, yes and no. It does that anyway. You think it forces it to do it or something. easy to assess in db3 if you jump out of the fire you'll burn until you land all oh, right i see okay okay let's see if we can get a few of these then And you. <laughs> Get these balled up and then go and see if we can pull a few more from elsewhere along the ridge. A few more along here. 
Yeah, I thought there was. Nowhere near as many on the other as as on the east side, but still. just as well it just maybe it is slightly faster with this I don't know feels it apart from the um, the recharge without the recharge it would be like if it had like a three second recharge it'd be way more way more fun I'm doing the jump thing, it's just not making any difference though. XP! Now they're a right mess now. Can't zoom out far enough to see any though. It doesn't feel like a lot of more XP than the Borgs did though, really. the Borgs were, you know, probably about the same XP, it just easier. Even though we're in Shadowlands, even with an XP boost and a bunch of XP armor, etc. It's sort of weird, really. I know people level up to 160 on these, but that's when they're pulling, you know, 40, 50 at a time. hated being the NT in Hex as you showed up. First thing said, can you pull? Two NTs are always made for more fun. Mob density, honestly, yeah. I'm going any more? There should be more here. There's one. I don't want to try east side though. I'm I'm thinking that's <laughs> asking for trouble. Why are there so many lost ermites here? I'm not seeing anything up ahead. Well, I could do east if it's free, and the chances are it probably ain't. More likely not than is. One. I'm only going to use VE on it. As long as it's moving, it's not hitting. That's the real thing with it, to keep it moving. 
which comes from the oblique of the curve you're running on. You don't run in a circle. More of an ellipse. That's the way I learned anyway. It works. Doesn't need jumping. Doesn't need more range. It's keeping it moving that makes it work. Yeah, an, uh, an ellipse. As if you've taken a perfect circle and done that with it. Like looking at a cup. There you go. An ellipse is... Here's a cup from last night that had hot chocolate in it. That's a circle. The shape you now see... Not very good, I suppose, but... That, that's a circle. That's an ellipse. That's, that's an extreme ellipse, and that's a straight line. Siljar Russell, what you wanted me to look at something before I pulled a bunch of mobs, didn't you? Oh, hang on. IKEA confesses their meatballs are made out of people that didn't find the exit. Where can I find the recipe? I have the ingredients. <laughs> Uh, that's, that's dark. <laughs> Ovals are ellipses, yeah. Well, an oval can be... A, a, an, e an egg is an oval, whereas an ellipse has an equilibrium, has a symmetry across the centre. That's why it's not an oval. I see no hecklers, so we're going to go and have a look on the east side, the danger side. Are we feeling that brave? We're going to attempt that. And the thing out here as well is, um, when you go out into the water, Shadowlands, see the white sort of shoreline bit on there? That's where it starts going dark. That's what that marker is. Cal can do it, Cal can do it. Cal's going to go splat trying, I think, is what's going to happen. Or we'll get there and there'll be like a 220 enforcer running around, giving it mongo, 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 mongo. The area will be busied. Hundfu, good evening. Welcome to the stream. We're gooning around with heckler fun. Jumping away at that. Oh, I've only, I didn't get more than one um, insignia, did I? Yeah, I would not be trying this with, um, what do you call it? Oh, Adonis Hecklers. I think I'll be very dead very fast. So you posted a video on this NT earlier this week. Yeah, several actually. It's, it, they're, they're just the VODs from the streams, basically. Elysium is brilliant though, in design, and it just needs like a high level version of it somewhere. Adonis and Pen Hex are a fun group of run, forest, run. Yeah, you're not kidding. See there, you've got a nice big flat surface to play around on. And lag. That's the one thing that'll kill you with hecklers if that happens. Suddenly, 
you walk back into the middle of all of them. Feels like Space Quest just got hold of you and went, no, no, you missed them. The Seekers are here. Look, you missed them. And he's like, ow. <laughs> Yeah, it's quite funny when he does that. And it is on again this Saturday. Kills you when you do Mox. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you can keep max range, she's not too bad, but it's usually lag. Yeah. Lag will kill you every time. Uh, should we run all the way south to the teleport? I think we should. One second too close to Moxie. Yeah, exactly. Hits like a train. I know people that can solo her, but poof, not easy. Yeah, I can see what you mean about Kells, but... Eh. Yeah, I've got... Only got like, what, 80 meg connection? Connect it like 79 or something like that. And I still get sudden packet loss like that. Okay. Uh, maybe start at Shell Beach. There's hecklers down there. Okay, it looks like it could be clear. 80% of the times she hits you once. Yeah, it's the stun and the second hit. That's what finishes you. Oh, lordy, lordy. How many are we going to get? Too many. going to be a lot of them. Running into the darkness. how many I've got here but it's a lot okay here's where we die you're in jumping there's a guard down here as well great you end up screwing it up completely I think we could do. Yep, got the guard. Damn. Didn't see him until I saw him. And it was just too late. Yeah, nah. The guard's in exactly the wrong place. Time to bail out of that. Yeah, he was right down in the middle. Why he was in the middle of the um, hecklers, I have no idea. Yeah. Someone probably pulled him there. Yeah, not intentionally, I think. What level is the guard? Like 250 or something? 300 maybe? Yeah, I've tried doing Moxie on the NT before. Got stunned, got dead. 
Yeah, he's, he's too high. He was hitting me for like 1k. Hey, we landed on him or the blind or something. And I saw him just uh, just as I was casting. It was like, well, I can't actually stop at the moment, so. Had to bail. Maybe he's reset by now. They don't normally stay off their mark, do they? They normally jump back up on the ramp and hang there. We will see. We will see how we get on. I bet he's still down here. I think he's actually gone. Okay. want to zoom out further <laughs> it's not happening can I not snag these come on these are gonna end up getting snagged anyway Okay, should have most of them by now. Kind of looks like. Okay, some of them are kind of not joining in with the others. Come on, you lot. Look, squishy little NT. Kill me! I'm here! There's a lot of them now. <laughs> it's a lot of mobs. sure how many are in that little pile I can't zoom out enough Slowly but surely. I think that heel pet's helping quite a bit. <laughs> Feels like there's a delay on the uh, on the damage spam window, you know. Did the east side, or at least a bit of it. 
when kiting you need to learn some Chinese words to scream when the team runs into your kite just like the old days. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> you used to have the, the, the gold farmers. It is exciting. What level are we at now? 148, yeah. Look at this. these buggers didn't come. Delica. Granted, I am butching this, but me how? <laughs> okay. Your NT streaming seems to be a heel pet magnet. It kinda does. Yeah. Now he's reset, he's back up here now, at least. Okay. I think I'm going to leave it there for this evening. I will be back tomorrow anyway, so no worries there. We'll do a bit more. The plan is um, 160 Ice Golem Tooth straight to Inferno before Saturday. Um, so that I can come along to the uh, Space Quest Aliens event and get a ton more XP. Thus far... We can go to um, the Rubicar one, obviously. Nascence and Adonis. But if I could get to Inferno as well, uh, well, that would be the cherry on top. Yes, it would. That would be some serious power levelling. Considering I wasn't high enough level for Adonis on the last one, which was about, was literally like less than two weeks ago, or just over two weeks ago. I think I'd made him on the Thursday, he was in the Rubicar one and the Adonis, on the uh, Nascence one on the last event, so it'd be pretty funny if he was in Inferno on this one. <laughs> Yes, kiting is fun, you all. Yes, it is. Right, is anybody else streaming a bit of Anarchy Online? Let's have a look. I think it's doable. Ten more levels in that many days. Anyone we like? Um, uh, Ms. Jazz, or whatever, my jazz. Go right then. They're doing the whole Iron Man thing, aren't they? Oh, great adverts. There we go. We go raid this person. Okay, they're doing alien something or other. Is that everybody that wants to go? Surely we can bring more. You're all off to bed. Okie dokie. Come on. She looks... She doesn't look... She looks tired. Wake her up a bit with a load of people. <laughs> that could be funny. Right, okay. I shall leave it here. I will see you all tomorrow for some more fun. And until then, bye for now.